Mungenga says the project set up to provide affordable housing should focus on phasing out informal settlements. Why should we always go and look for land at a different place to be serviced uh, instead of uh, targeting the informal settlement areas and saying that our strategy with the reintroduction of Build Together should be to phase out informal settlement areas and then start, uh, um, you know, so that we know uh, when we talk about informal settlement areas uh, in 2030, that it should be very minimal because now we do not have a specific strategy uh, that is supposed to be facing out uh, informal settlement areas. Another Swapo MP, Victoria Kauma, in her contribution, wants the Ministry of Health and Social Services to complete the maternity ward at the Rundu State Hospital. Kauma, who is also the councillor for the Rundu Urban Constituency in the Kavango East region, says the construction of the ward has not been completed due to budget cuts. When we come to equipments and even the spaces of our maternity wards, it is so small that not all women can fit. If you went to all hospitals, you will see that even women, when it's waiting for delivery, they are sleeping on the, the floor, very cold floor. And you are expecting that women to deliver a health child. It is impossible. She further called on government to construct more health facilities in Rundu to provide for the growing population due to urban migration. Salmi Hangula, NBC News, Parliament.